Good morning and welcome back to In The Kitchen with Pen and it is January and I've been shopping so let's have a little look at our first shopping haul of 2024. It's not a lot but it feels like it was a lot, do you know what I mean? I've been to Lidl, well two Lidls and I've been to Heron food. I also went to the butchers, but unfortunately he didn't have what I wanted. But bless his little heart, he's taken my order, he's going to pack it exactly as I want it, and I'm collecting it tomorrow. So that is D and I Family Butchers in Bedford Square, Houghton Regis. So let's get on with this haul. Right then, I picked up a little magazine, always do, to see what they've got coming in in the next week. Bread, needed bread, and I've not tried this one before, but it was half the price of the Hovis, so I thought, well, let's give it a go. These rolls are really, really nice, but these are quite soft, so I'm going to pop them into the um, Speedy on steam bake for about six minutes, and they'll really crisp up beautifully. One pound fifteen for four. And these are ancient grain rolls. Onion barges. Steve's gonna have a curry, so a chicken star. It's not really a curry, is it? So onion barges. Uh, I got some of their soft cheese. So if ever you need um, cream cheese, buy the shop same brands. It's generally about half the price of the big brand names and it is every bit as good. Um, it's gonna snow later in the week, apparently. So you want nice warming dinners, don't you? So we've got a couple of pies here. Chicken and mushroom for Steve and chicken and gravy for me, because you all know mushrooms, as far as I'm concerned, are the devil's food. Needed some bacon, so smoked bacon, gonna have bacon. That bacon's got flavour, I smoked. Oops. Um, I'm gonna make a casserole later this week as well, so I needed some mushrooms and some carrots and some onions. Um, Mushroom in Lidl, Steve said to me, do we need new potatoes, tinned new potatoes? Because they're lovely, drained off and popped in your, seasoned and popped in your air fryer or in a beef casserole, then you've got everything in that one pot, absolutely perfect. They've got two sorts, one was 76 pence a tin, same size tin, and one was 38 pence a tin. Wow. I went for a twofer, so two at 38 pence or one at 76 percent. No brainer, isn't it? Also, in Lidl, so they've got an offer on at the moment with pineapple slices or chunks and peach slices. You can buy six for three pounds. I didn't need asking twice, so I bought four pineapple because I use those sometimes in um, stir fries and if we're having gammon obviously as well as as a dessert. So four pineapple and two of the peach and um, picked up one in juice and one in syrup. That was a mistake, they were supposed to both be in juice but that will teach me to look. Then Steve likes this, their chocolate milk. So chocolate milk. So, that was one, well it wasn't quite because I bought these in them as well. We also bought to go with Steve's curry some Papa John's. And I adore these pointed peppers. They are so nice. And they're in the little um, pick of the week this week. 79? Oh, I can't remember. 
and some curly kale really good for you really tasty i adore it it goes in soups it goes with as a side you can pop it in the air fryer crisp it up put a little bit of chinese five spice on it what have you got crispy seaweed eggs now the first little had no eggs no eggs so got some large eggs saw this couldn't resist it festive cheeses okay and in here there is wensleydale with cranberries double gloucester with onion and chives and a smoky cheddar with paprika and chili can you see 80 pence don't mind if i do oh, i think the um smoked oh the smoked one would be really nice in a mac and cheese wouldn't it hmm. okay and we bought some basil that's to go with my dinner later and these lemon and lime still drinks got those and this is what i went into little four was the vacuum sealer rolls the first little again didn't have any four pounds four pounds 99 and i've got three rolls in each they're really good these work in both of my vacuum sealers that's my food saver and my one from high street tv actually i think am i said 4.99 yeah, they were four ninety nine each. We've got like a pound since I first started buying them. So that's what I picked up, or we picked up in Lidl. And then opposite the butchers, across the road, there's a heron. So if we're there, we pop in. And um, really not a lot in here. Tea cakes, or oh, a cup of tea and a toasted tea cake. Eh? 33p. Ooh. Then we've got some of this garlic alioli, the dip. It's beautiful. You can cook with this as well, but just with some crudite or breadsticks, this is delicious. Um, oh, yeah. Stop pots. 85p. 85 hang on i don't want to tell you wrong it might have been 89 um 89 pence these are really good and 89 pence i was having some um steve picked these up have you got any room in the freezer yeah they're apple puffs and they were £1.79 and you've got four of them. Now, again, they'd be nice just cooked and have them with a cup of tea or with a bit of custard as it is a £1.79. I don't think that's bad at all. And then <laughs> Steve said, do you want some pockets? I really love pockets. But only this flavour. Toffee pockets. So I got five for two pounds. So that is today's little haul. Not a lot, but I think it's quite, you know, I'm quite happy. I've got everything I wanted. But one thing I will point out to you, Herons and B&M are the same place. Herons are owned by B&M. B&M we have next door and Steve likes this, which I'll show you. And I paid £2.29 on, I paid £2.29 on Saturday. For this he said to me pen how much do you pay for the poppets hot chocolates i told him and it was two pounds 69 in there 40p dearer i think that's a little bit naughty myself but nonetheless so if you like hot chocolate this salted caramel steve thoroughly recommends so that's it I'm done. I've got to put this away. Find room in the freezer. Wish me luck. And thank you for watching. And I'll see you on the next In the Kitchen with Pain. Bye bye.